Welcome back to Arsenal News TV and today we are going to look at the four latest Arsenal news. The first Arsenal news is that Tuto Makata Webb has confirmed an exclusive Arsenal update, as they confirm Arsenal above all in race to rescue betrayed 80 million euro striker, as Arsenal look to complete the signing of World Cup Serbia international and Juventus forward Dusan Vlahovic. Dusan Vlahovic is being linked with a Juventus exit and Arsenal appear to be one of the striker's main admirers again. Arsenal and Newcastle United are reportedly interested in rescuing Serbia international. Dusan Vlahovic from Juventus this summer, the 23-year-old caught the attention of clubs around Europe at the start of last season as he scored 20 goals in 24 appearances for Fiorentina. Arsenal were interested in buying Vlahovic during the January transfer window in 2022 but he ended up joining Juventus for a potential total fee of €80 million. Euros. The forward has struggled to live up to this price tag over the past 18 months. He has only scored 23 goals in 63 appearances for the Italian giants. Juventus are set to miss out on the Champions League after being deducted 10 points for false accounting. This has fueled talk that Vlahovic could leave the club, with Chelsea and Man United among the sides being linked with him. But a report from Italian outlet Tuto Mercato Web claims Arsenal and Newcastle are the two clubs interested in the Serbian dot. Juventus paid €80 million Euros for the striker and they are now asking for exactly the same money to give him away. Vlahovic refused all other destinations to join Juventus and he feels betrayed by the club this season as a result of their poor performances. The Gunners are above all in the race for Vlahovic and they are said to be willing to rescue him from Juventus. The Turin outfit are ready to say goodbye as the attackers' exit would fund their move for Atalanta youngster Rasmus Hodgland. All eyes will be on Arsenal after their previous failure to beat Juventus to his signature. A year and a half later, they could have the last laugh by prizing him away from the old lady. To sign him, though, they would have to meet Juventus' valuation of Vlahovic. Ideally, the Turin outfit want to recoup the 80 million euros they paid for him, in other words, a deal could be possible for Arsenal to sign Vlahovic for around £69 million. If he can get back to his best, he might be an upgrade on Gabriel Jesus. The second Arsenal news is that Sky Germany's Florian Plettenberg has confirmed an exclusive Arsenal update, as he confirms World Cup winner wants to leave amid Arsenal chase to complete the signing of World Cup France international and Bayern Munich defender Benjamin Pavard, reporter claims World Cup winner wants to leave amid Arsenal chase. Benjamin Pavard has told Bayern Munich that he wants to leave this summer amid interest from Arsenal. Arsenal may have real hope of signing Benjamin. Pavard with the Bayern Munich defender angling for a summer exit, that is according to Sky Germany's Florian Plettenberg, who reports that Pavard wants to leave Bayern this summer. Plettenberg notes that Pavard will not extend his contract and he has now communicated to Bayern that he wants to go this summer. Pavard is out of contract in 2024 and seemingly doesn't want to hang around until he becomes a free agent, maybe Bayern would rather keep hold of Pavard than lose him now, but they would be wise to cash in before he leaves for nothing. Pavard helped Bayern win yet another league title on Saturday but has already told Bayern he wants to leave. Plettenberg adds that Barcelona are in for Pavard, but there have also been linked to Arsenal of late. 90 Minutes reported just last week that Arsenal have shown an interest in signing Pavard this summer. Newcastle United are also thought to be in the mix for Pavard, who isn't short of suitors. Pavard will be very attractive to Arsenal for a number of reasons. Primarily his versatility, Pavard can play as a right-back or centre-back, much like Ben White, and can add competition in both areas. Can you imagine if Arsenal had Pavard or White stepping into centre-back to cover for William Saliba? That's a major upgrade on Rob Holding and Arsenal could now push to sign 27-year-old Pavard in a cut-price move. Pavard's record of winning can't be ignored either, especially with Arsenal placing a focus on adding winners last summer in Alexander Zinchenko and Gabriel Jesus. Pavard has now won four league titles at Bayern as well as a Champions League, whilst he has even won a World Cup with France. The former Lille and Stuttgart ace has become very accustomed to winning and that's the kind of character Arsenal need moving forward. The third Arsenal news is that Bild has confirmed an exclusive Arsenal update as they confirm player has lucrative offer from Arsenal, as Arsenal look to complete the signing of Spain international and Real Voyager lead star Yvonne Fresneda, Gunners can spend more to beat competition for signing, 
Borussia Dortmund will face tough competition from Arsenal to sign Real Valladolid star Yvonne Fresneda in the summer. The Bundesliga side are set to raise at least 100 million euros from Jude Bellingham's impending sale to Real Madrid. That's according to Bild, who state BVB plan to reinvest those funds on signing three new players, Fresneda has been identified as a target for the right-back position. But Dortmund have to be wary about the threat they will face from Arsenal, that's because the 18-year-old has a lucrative offer from the Gunners. Bild provide no further details about the North London club's proposal, but this could cause concerns at Dortmund. Earlier this month, Bild reported Mikel Arteta's side can spend significantly more to beat competition from the German club to acquire the fullback's signature. Arsenal have been credited with interest in Fresneda since the start of this year. Back in March, the defender admitted he's proud to be linked to the Gunners, I'm proud, but I always say it, I'm also at a big club, Oyedo lead, he told AS, I have always valued studies with a view to the future. Beyond football. I am a person who likes to learn languages. Fresneda has a deal until lasting 2025 and has made 24 appearances for Voyadolid during the 2022-23 season. The 18-year-old has made an impressive impact for the La Liga side this term as he has played 24 times across all competitions. Voyadolid are in the relegation places heading into the final day of the La Liga season this weekend and Fresneda is expected to leave the club even if they stay up. The final Arsenal news is that Calcio Mercato has confirmed an exclusive Arsenal update, as they confirm Arsenal to open serious talks in the summer to complete the signing of Nigeria international and Villarreal winger Samuel Chukwiz. According to a new report, Arsenal has revived their interest in Villarreal winger Samuel Chukwiz and is preparing to initiate talks for his potential signing in the coming weeks. The Gunners had previously missed the opportunity to sign Chukwiz when he was younger, but he has since developed into a top player at Viral. Viral is now prepared to consider offers from clubs for the talented winger services at the end of the current season. After making significant progress this season, Mikel Arteta's side is eager to continue their development in the upcoming campaign, and Chukwiz is one of the players they are targeting to strengthen their squad, as reported by Calcio Mercato. Given Chukwiz's desire for a new challenge, reaching an agreement on personal terms should be relatively straightforward. A potential stumbling block for any of the clubs is Chukwiz's contract, which includes a release clause of £88 million, but his Deal expires in the summer of 2024 so Viral will be under pressure to sell or face losing him for free this summer. Chukwiz joined the Spanish club in 2017 after learning his trade at Nigeria's Diamond Academy. Chukwiz has dazzled for Viral in the last few seasons and might become a star in the Premier League if we add him to our group now. Chukwiz has enjoyed a brilliant season for the Yellow Submarine, notching 13 goals and 11 assists in all competitions. However, we have so many attacking wide players in the squad now and might have to offload some before we can add him to the group. We also must be prepared to pay a good fee to add him to our squad ahead of the other suitors chasing his signature now. Do you know the Arsenal news on Joao Cancelo? You will enjoy this video on your screen too.